Yes guys and welcome back to yet another FIFA 21 content based video. Today I'm going to be teaching you the ultimate tutorial on how to get better in FIFA 21. If you're not already then make sure you subscribe so you do not miss on any more of this content as it really helps channel grow. So in this video I'm going to teach you the best skill moves tutorials, the best finishing tutorials and the best skill games to get good at. So this is ultimately going to improve your rank in foot champs and div rivals. So yeah, let's get into the video. So first of all, I want to show you some skill moves which you definitely need to implement in your game. The first being very, very simple is actually going to be agile dribbling. And as you can see here, Neymar is very, very good at it. Players with better dribbling are often better at this agile dribbling tool. All you have to do is simply hold RB. It tricks out the opponents and it's very, very easy to do. The second skill I want to show you is actually the bridge dribble. Now, the bridge dribble is very, very easy. All you have to do is double tap your RB button, as you can see here. He does a slight little turn and runs the other way, which is absolutely fantastic, guys. So definitely try and implement in your game. The first skill move is actually going to be the hill to hill flick. Definitely one of my favorite film skill moves in the game. It's simply up and down on the joystick. If you're going um, up the pitch, if you're going down the pitch, then it's down and up. I just remember it from um, ball to body, so if you're um, literally going forwards then it's up down because the ball's in front of you, if you're going right then it'll be right left because the ball's in front of you again. Um, as you can see you've also got the controller overlay right there it should be, so yeah, make sure you check that out if you do not know how to do these skill moves. Now there's only two more skill moves I actually want to show you, one being the roulette, very similar um, to the... Um, it's like a three star skill move actually, so yeah, most players can do this roulette and it's actually a very very good skill move to get hold of. Now, I'd usually say do the rainbow flick, but the rainbow flick is nowhere near as effective as this roulette skill move. As you can see here, you can do it both directions depending on which way you um, do the joystick. And as you can see on the controller overlay, you know how I'm doing it. I'm simply going up on the joystick, I'll do it slowly, it won't work, but listen to the controller overlay right there. So you're going to go up on the joystick and wrap around. And if you do it fast, you'll be able to see. Um, actually, no, it's the other way around. So it'll basically be the other way around. So you go down and then up as follows. So as you can see there, I'm doing it perfectly there. The other way is actually the Elastico, which is the one I want to show you next. Because um, although this skill move is very, very good, it does require a five-star skiller. So it's literally the opposite of an Elastico on a roulette. So instead of going from the bottom, you're going to go from the top. So up on the joystick and then wrap around again. And as you can see, if you do it whilst moving, he'll do the Elastico. Now, with none of these skill moves, can you do um, while sprinting except from the bridge dribble? I also give you a, a slight little bonus skill move to definitely implement in your game. It will be the ball roll, as you can see here. I'm sure most of you know how to do this already. So now guys I'm going to teach you how to actually practice your finishing in skill games and the best way to finish goals um, in general. So what we're going to do is actually head into the um, skill games right now if I can find them. And then what we're going to do is actually go into some, I actually can't do it on here, uh, what we're going to do is actually shoot in basics. Now what you want to do um, with your shooting is very very simple. What you want to do is basically finish your shots, practice your top bin shots. I know that's really really bad but I'm using a bad player. And yeah, the, the way I wanted to show you basically is doing a slight fake shot. It's very, very good and it's very, very handy to get the hold of as it's really going to help you in your game. So I'll try and find a skill move for that really, really quickly or a skill game for that really, really quickly. Um, hopefully you can find it. As you can see, all of these are sadly blocked. However, there might be a practicing scenario, as you can see here, rookie attacking scenarios, which will be perfect for the way I want to teach you how to finish. Now, these attacking scenarios, in my opinion, are the perfect way on how to get better in FIFA 21, as not only does it teach you how to pass, it also teaches you if they're offside or not, and basically is very, very realistic. So, the way I actually wanted you to practice your shots or finishing is fake shotting around the goalkeeper like so. It's very, very crucial, guys, and I recommend using X and A. Uh, the reason for X and A is because it's so, so much quicker than pressing B and A, and it feels so much better, or if you're on PlayStation, B and X. Um, as you can see there, if you do a fake throw, it doesn't always work, whereas a, f um, a fake pass, it always works, and it's very, very similar. Um, it's also much quicker. So, yeah, the fake shot or the fake pass is much, much better. And, yeah, um, definitely um, practice the attacking scenarios, as they're definitely going to help you in your game. Again, X and A to go around the goalkeeper, 100% the best way to finish in FIFA 21. As you can see, I'm missing there, but these aren't the best players. So, again, um, you want to basically maximize your opportunity in scoring that goal by fake shotting around the goalkeeper and having an open net so again we're going to carry on fake shot in and this is very very crucial guys as you can see here is absolutely class so we're going to fake shot and basically open up an opportunity for ourselves uh, it's very very good guys and it's basically going to fall out their goalkeeper 
So guys, that is the ultimate finishing and skill move tutorial on the channel. I'll quickly show you again why fake shotting is so good, as you can just see there. So guys, that is the ultimate guide on FIFA 21. If you did like the video, it would be greatly appreciated if you could subscribe, as it really helps the channel grow, as well as implementing these skill moves in your game, as it's really going to help you finish and basically get better as well as improve your rank. So guys, have a nice day, have a nice week, and goodbye, and don't forget to subscribe.